In this clip we're going to look at how to create a lookup to be used by your standard end users. The example on the screen is a transactional report, so a list report based on the vendor account. As I change the filter for the vendor account, the report refreshes automatically. We can see it's currently displaying all customers, beginning with two. I'd like to add a lookup to make it easier for my end user. To do so, I just select the free format lookup panel. I select my table, in this case the vendors table. Filter, I could add a filter if I wished, but I won't in this occasion. A filter I could add, for example, could be the vendor group. Instead, I'm just gonna go straight to the output and select the information I'd like to display to my end user, my standard user. I'd like the vendor account, I'd like the name. Now, in actual fact, the name is the rec ID in X2012. So I'm going to use the Atlas join or extended data type facility to join directly to the global address book from which I will select the name. Just for illustration purposes, I'm going to leave both names in my lookup. I click OK. I'm just going to push this name to the top of the list. Select Insert. We can see that Atlas is defaulted to the first value. But as this lookup feature is for a standard user, if I now change my license to standard, place my cursor in the vendor account, we can see that we have all of our vendor accounts with the name from the global address book and also the rec ID, which is also known in X2012 as the name. As soon as I select any of my filters, Atlas refreshes the report automatically. We can multi-select values and apply those values. And you can actually use the select all, which will just filter based on any value.